What's up, Baby Sun Gang? It's London. And Kush. And draw London time. Hello! Before we get into this reaction, instead of a. Aw, oh, damn it. Before we get into this reaction, um, instead of a promotion, I want to promote my own channel, my music channel, where I'm going to be posting all my music, which is going to be coming up soon. Just filmed a music video, things are getting ready. So if you click the link in the description or the pinned comments for my channel, go subscribe, put the notifications on. I'd be very grateful if you did that. If you haven't seen my reaction to Yesterday's Cypher with the baby, Megan the Stallion, and who else was in it? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding but yeah, if you haven't seen that, then click the card somewhere on the screen and uh, you can check that out. If you guys already did check that out, then you know that I was most excited for Rico Nasty and Kitty, get down. Get down. Corday and Rico Nasty next, so that's today. I'm excited. I'm freaking stoked. I don't know why I said it like that, but I did. So anyways, let's just not even wait any longer. Let's just get into this right this second. I have a feeling that this one's gonna be good. Yeah. I'm doing some yoga up in here. Yeah. 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 Who's saying that? Doesn't sound like Blueface or a Corday, but if I were to guess, yeah. it's Blueface. I ain't never asked who I had out, but it came up now. Everybody got a hand out. I took out my truck all night, where it would have probably said it. Put the pussy on the make a nigga tap out. Just stay where I'm a nigga pop out. If you don't get a picture, who caught you? I was thinking about pussy like shadows. Did the witch of a mic? Okay, let me just. Kitty, we're not doing this today. The girls this year are super dope. Like, girls are really killing it more and more. I used to be one of those people that was like, oh, I don't really like listening to girls rapping. That's not really my thing. Not that I don't like respect them or think, you know, it's just not what I wanted to listen to necessarily. But lately I've been listening to so many female rappers because they're just, they're getting doper and doper, honestly. I think maybe it's because I didn't really like the whole like pop rap type thing. like. No offense to Nicki Minaj fans, but that was more, that was less of the kind of rap that I liked listening to. But the girls this year, like I said, like they're just Megan The Stallion, freaking Rico Nasty, like they're killing it. I like that line. Um, I mean, I like a lot of her lines. I really like when she switches up her flow and she does that like, Doo -doo -doo, you know, how she goes like lower. I'm not good at describing things, but I really like when she switches it up like that. Plus, she gives me kind of a, I know lots of people are going to disagree with me on this, but on some of her songs like Rage, Smack a Bitch, Counting Up, I think it's called Counting Up, I'm not sure. She gives me kind of like a Zilla Kami vibe because, I might have said that wrong, but um, because she has that kind of rock influence like you hear a little bit of that and I, I love when she has the raspiness in her voice and she just goes hard like that that's like my favorite songs by her my cat is spazzing out and it's really distracting to me I'm sorry okay anyways see I love that same what was his pose right there? I know he's about to drop some knowledge on us and he's about to make me want to go in the library for a couple uh, years. So let's just prepare ourselves. Just kidding, you guys probably already heard this. So it's just me preparing myself right now. Kind of switch it up, friend. See, what's the cost of a dollar when you don't have shit and you down up on your last bit? And every moment pass, it makes you wonder what could happen. Sipping Henny Frozen, feeling spaced out like a semicolon, made a million. <laughs> Friggin', okay. First of all, I paused it not because of what Blueface said, but then I just heard that in the last thing, how he's all semi-cool and like trying to add the ad lib in. You know? It's good to have some help. Anyways, yeah, I was right. I already want to go in the library. He never talks about some flexing. I mean, he, he does use that in some songs, but it's like mostly his songs are about something a lot deeper, you know, that people should be listening to, should be hearing about, should be educated on, whatever. He's just a very smart guy. He's wise beyond his... He's an old soul is what would be the proper term for him. Life is really golden, but what's most important when you hope for portions of a dope endorsement? Only hang with their own brands, no broken horses. Oh, fuck a bitch of luxury, she gave me plush brain. Got no time for love games, got too much fame. What's in his pocket? Oh, that's just like a... 
I don't know brands, it's probably some like fancy brand that I don't even know that has the blue circle on, on the pants. I have no idea what that is. It's an interesting... Anyways, that's not what this is about. It's not about fashion. It's about the music. Love game got too much fame. The issue is all the lies is told too habituous to the point where... See, what is that word? Actually, I feel like I kind of know it. But I also couldn't give you a definition, so do I? Probably not. You don't realize what type of bitch you is. I like how we just rhymed that with... Envious niggas. Been that way since the beginning till infinity, nigga. Life gon' be grand like my father's dad. Nigga, we gon' take that was smart. that you thought you had. I said, uh, done my old bitch cause she was too basic. Now my new girl claiming that I'm too racist. I feel like... Claiming that he's too racist. I guess maybe he'll explain that in a second. I don't know. But what was I going to say? I don't know why I'm deciding to comment on this line out of everything that he said. <clears throat> but I am. Anyways, um, not that this is true or anything. But yeah, if, I feel like why being Corday, he needs someone who's woke. Because him himself, he himself, is that. Like, how would, it, would even a conversation be between him and someone who's based? I don't, I don't know. Cause I don't really like green, only blue faces. Okay. Okay, I get the racist thing now. Fit new to the shoelaces, huh? They say that he's so classy, but I just want to be popping like Rico Nasty. I like how he did that. Oh gosh. I like how they put blue face last because Corday, he's a lyrical genius. Rico Nasty, she's fucking just dope. She's dope as hell. Her raps, everything. I watched a, I didn't even mention this before, but I watched a DJ Vlad interview with her from, I don't know, it was like a year or two ago. She's been through some shit. It just makes it more inspiring that she worked as hard as she did and she is where she is because some people, when they face shit like that, you can either go like two ways. You can either go even more downhill or you can rise up, you know? And she did that in a very big way. Like this is only like the beginning for her. And she's been doing this for the second, but like I just see her getting super big. How we just came in. He did the Superman. I would like say I just went stupid. If he tripping, then he falling. Stupid. Drop top mark no long. Does everyone just like I just wonder. I just wonder. Just like just every I just wonder, does everyone just like trip around him? Because he always talks about people tripping around him. Or just people tripping in general. Like, has he seen a lot of people trip? Because I haven't. And I'm a clumsy person, so I've tripped a good amount, but like not as much. Okay. I just wonder, do like just a bunch of people just trip around him constantly? Because he's always talking about people tripping. I don't know. That was a bad joke. I don't know if that was a joke or a sarcasm, honestly. Sometimes I don't even know with myself. So. You're not alone if you're confused. I need a impossible to play with my rules. I miss the possible. Hate to be my ex because she's salty like some Lucas. No time for nonsense. I need a deposit. I wanted to be rich instead of regular, so I left college. I get. I mean, I graduated from college, and if I did, if, yeah, that was. But that's a whole nother conversation that doesn't have anything to do with this. Um, what was I going to say? I'm actually pretty impressed by Blueface. Like, I thought it was going to be... I was feeling bad that he was in a category with Rico and Cordae. I was like, oh, he's going to have to be on their side for... But one, he's on beat, from, from what I can hear. And two, he's not. it's not bad at all, to be honest. And I like the energy that him and Cordae had in the beginning. You know, it just it just helps when people aren't standing there in the back like... Like they sometimes do. I like when they have energy too. I know it's a long day for them, but this is like a pretty big day. So, you know, get that energy up. So I like the energy that they were giving too. I get paid to vote just to do the least. I get paid to preach the word like a priest. It's easy. Famous trip niggas could never be me. Ain't takes her back, but she still got the message. Ooh. I know you have to do that. Ooh. One thing about Blueface that I always thought ever since like the first song I heard him do was he, that he has such a Bay Area vibe. Like, how he flows, the ooh, even though I've not really heard ooh's exactly like his. But, you know, if you're from the Bay, if you used to, if you grew up on Bay Area music, Bay Area rap, like what I did, um, that's just what I feel. Like, that's just the vibe I feel. But he's not from there, so I get confused. Just like I always thought Problem, all of his songs, even though he's obviously not from the Bay, they just have a Bay Area vibe. There's just some people. Either way, I'm not complaining. If you're from the Bay, let me know if you think the same. Or if you're from somewhere else, let me know if you think that I'm totally wrong. Either way, I liked this cipher. Um, 
Either way, I really like the cipher. It's definitely one of my favorites. There's only been two. It's definitely one of my favorites, meaning it's my favorite. But Megan and DaBaby killed it the other day, so. Hello! That's it for this video, though. So until next time, 3% gang, Lolo, Kush, out. I'm a challenge and I know that I've been damaged and I know that never try to hide it. Demons inside of me. Just never try to fight them. You'll see it if you lie to me. A lot of crazy eyes, but you'll never see me cry.